Ladies and gentlemen, this contest set for one fall is for the WWE Championship. He's producing first, he's the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing 251 pounds, John C. On June 6, 2005, in this very building in the city of St. Louis, John Cena was strapped to the Monday Night Raw. It is a night that changed the direction of this program and the entire WWE forever. Boy, you're right about that. John Cena has become maybe the most integral part of Monday Night Raw ever. From Chicago, Illinois, weighing 218 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, C.M. Punk. Earlier tonight, we asked the WWE Universe to join us in a poll on Twitter to see who you would like to see The Rock face at the Royal Rumble. CM Punk, Big Show, or John Cena? Well, the results are in. And according to you, the WWE Universe, you want The Rock to face CM Punk at the Royal Rumble in January for the WWE Championship. John Cena looking to make history here tonight on this 1,000th episode of Monday Night Raw. And I can't even begin to tell you how many huge matches we've had over the years, but this may be the biggest. For the 53rd time in the history of Monday Night Raw, the WWE Championship is being defended here tonight. Tie up. This is about skill and power. John Cena, of course, is made of flesh and blood, like you or me. He can be hurt. He can be defeated. Well, he may be made of flesh and blood, but he's completely unlike you and me, Michael. There's unquestionably something special about John Cena. He drops the elbow. The kick connects. Oh, a reversal. Oh. King John Cena had the Money in the Bank contract for just eight days before cashing it in here tonight. Well, you're right, Michael. Only three men in history have held the Money in the Bank briefcase for shorter periods of time. Jack Swagger had it for two days in 2010. Kane cashed his in on the same night he won it in 2010. And Edge held it for one day in 2007 before cashing it in. And it's important to note, Cole, Edge actually won his 2007 Money in the Bank contract by beating that year's original Money in the Bank winner in a one-on-one -on -one match. And he snaps off the Hurricane Lana. Oh, going to the top, high risk. Wow, he's, look out. I'm not sure 
But with a miss like that, I'm wondering if he has something in his eye. Uh-oh, what is CM Punk going to do here? Watch it! You know, it's hard to believe, Cole, but Monday Night Raw has been around to see some of sports entertainment's biggest concepts both come and go. Of course, you have to include Monday Night Raw, which launched in September 1995 and aired its final episode in March of 2001. Hey, and there's also WCW Thunder, Sunday Night Heat, Raw Magazine, oh, the XFL, and the Hardcore Championship. I still wonder how I never won that title. Wasn't everybody a hardcore champion at one point? And let's not forget two of the greatest factions in sports entertainment history. The NWO and D-Generation X. Monday Night Raw is... That's it. He's done. Oh, CM Punk so confident coming into tonight. He said in an interview with WWE.com that... That's and look at for the AA. And now the official oh. inadvertently knocked out of the ring. Attitude adjustment to Punk. That's it. Wait, wait! The referee was not completely out of the ring. He's out on the floor. Well, Cena had pumped out for a three count there. Cena should win the championship. Cena's gonna hang. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god! Cena, you gotta look out! The big show! What a runner with Cena! Oh, we got fair! Cena almost cut in half with that spear and now. Oh, what a KO punch! Cena's been knocked out by the big show. Well, this victory's just been handed to CM Punk by the big show. Yeah, but King, first he's got to get the official back in the ring. The official was knocked out of the ring. There's no referee to count the one, two, three here. Punk doing what he can to get the official back in the ring. If Punk can get that referee back in the ring, he could end this thing right now. Big elbow. See him Punk gathering attention in a hurry. John Cena being pressed hard. And what a reversal from CM Punk. You know, it's only appropriate that these two men face off for the WWE Championship on this historic night. I think it was last year in the summer of 2011 when CM Punk dropped his now famous pipe bomb. He then went on to take the WWE title from John Cena and walk out of the WWE only to return and change the direction of his company. He's got him up! Whoa! Oh. Oh, he's going to sleep to the problem. 
a bull. What is Punk done? 